They said, do not dwell into the future. Do not dwell into the past. Concentrate your mind at the specific moment. But unfortunately, unfortunately, I have this superpower. What is that that you're looking at? I can virtually, in fact, time travel with realistic, uh, time travel with realistic imagination, which is completely fictional, correct? From my eyes or point of view, that is my unique ability. That is my unique superpower. I can time travel into any imaginative place, including the mind of a fictional character, to the power of my creative imagination. This means I can dream with my eyes open and visualize things that may not have actually have happened. I can start my fictional like story narration from what the eyes of the character would actually see, be it a painting, be it a movie, be it a book, be it an object. I can actually be there and feel it. That is my unique superpower. I can visualize a city, a village, an alien planet, the surroundings of the place with people walking and running. In real time, guys, this is in real time. Vehicles by land, sea, or space travel, weather of the place, fire, sparks, snow, rain, era, or timeline of the visualization. Maybe it is during a war time or a flood, a futuristic earth, or a global warming era. The dialogues and language of the people and inhabitants, and I can speak to those fictional people. And I can see, smell, taste, sound, and feel the place and the mood-based immersion like happiness, sadness, anger, etc. Through this, how is the superpower useful? I can unravel fictional mysteries or combinations of any type with my creativity. Filmmakers, authors, or creative directors can use my superpowers, my creative superpowers, to craft unique plot lines in their films. Even hundreds of climaxes or twists can be given by me. There is no creative block for me forever. Based on this, I can decipher the concept between mysterious paintings, artworks, sculpture work, book, etc. by time traveling to the exact time when the work was painted or created and see it from the painter's eye, eye or the perspective to what happens in real time. I can actually travel complete fictional cities and world through imagination and narrate in real time what I'm seeing during the travel with closed eyes. Like if I have to go on a car or a bullock cart or a spaceship, I can narrate what is happening in real time. I can also venture in the mind of an artist or anybody's one, uh, anyone or any scene or a scientist and see through his mind like Einstein or whatever it is, I can see what is that brain thinking. Correct? I can even completely narrate an unwritten imaginative book with chapter titles and stories in real time or anything that you wish for. If there are logical scenarios, I will need time to understand the logic and then once done with that extremely fast, I will start my visualization. Through the power of my unlimited imagination, the creative superpower that is God's gift in me, I was born with the creative superpower. You can look at my superpowers and what is this ability and read in depth at creativesuperpowers.weebly.com which is given in the video description. My name is Srinidhi Ranganathan and I'm going to show you the demo of my talent or the skill or the superpower that I possess right now. So now, uh, Sananya will actually, uh, uh, you know, give a picture, okay, a particular image, or it can be anything, a keyword or whatever, uh, image also, and based on that, uh, uh, we will see the demo, okay? Sananya, you are going to show the picture? That is the picture? Can you show me the picture, Sananya? Just a minute. Yeah, just show me the picture. Hmm. You can search for it anywhere and give me the picture. Yeah. Did you find it? Yeah. I find a uh, picture. Hmm.
okay guys i'm going to give this picture to him mm. okay mm. okay based on whatever you give i'm going to go inside that image and feel that i am present at that particular location okay this is the image i'm going to give okay can you just me? she okay. once again uh, okay. okay okay now going i'm going to show this image to shrinidhi rangnathan okay okay i want to uh, see the image once again okay 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 i have seen the image so now i will keep the phone over here okay and i am going to close my eyes and visualize that i am inside a particular image which is completely fictitious through my visualization skills and powers you are going to see something incredible once i close my eyes charana will actually ask questions based on that as i am in that particular scene and i will answer the questions okay so let's begin charana for just one minute i visualize myself Charanya, I'm inside the picture. Okay. You can ask me questions, or I can start depicting it. Okay, you can start. Okay. I see the bright moon. I see uh, blue leaves shaped trees. I see a beach, kind of uh, a, a beach shore, and the waves uh, down, which comes in and goes. Okay. I can feel the salt air in my breath. Okay. It's night time, so the stars are not meant to be seen right now. Anyways, I'm not able to see any kind of star right now. Okay. But slowly, I see there are some. There is one star that is uh, very bright. Uh, and I look at it is in this direction, Charanya. As okay. I see that moon in this direction, the trees in the direction. I'm standing on the sand, beach sand. Okay. And this side, I saw one star. It is very strange that I'm not able to see other stars. Okay. Do I see other stars? Okay. Is anybody no. there on the tree show? There is nobody, Charanya. There is nobody. I am able to uh, see from this side, from the left side, Charanya. Okay. See from the right side. There is a small boy. Okay. Uh, what he is doing? He is sitting uh, on uh, in the sand, and he is at some uh, distance from me. Should I walk? Okay. Okay. Down. Uh, I see the sand. I see uh, crabs. Uh, all. Uh, and i see some pebbles see pebbles so should i walk to the boy or should i see back uh, go nearer to that boy and ask him name okay back i see a road okay i okay. see a road ask his name okay, that boy I'm name to the boy i'm what? walking the boy is at some distance hold on for a second i'm walking should i walk two steps at a time okay what color dress he is wearing he is wearing a white dress okay With the purple, uh, uh, small short drawer till here. Okay, right. Uh, his hair is black. Okay. 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 What will be the age of that boy? Uh, actually, he is very small. I don't know about the age factor, but uh, I think he must be some eight, eight or nine years uh, boy. He okay. is sitting there on the sand lonely. Okay. Okay, I see that. I when I go near, I see he is building a sand castle. The oh, castle that good. is from sand is building that right now, and I can see it's built like four uh, four floors in the castle made of sand. Oh, okay. Good. So when I see that side, I see there is a woman who is playing with a balloon. Oh, good. Uh, so that must be the boy's mother. I assume I don't know. Okay. The woman is holding a child. The child is holding the balloon. Uh, the woman is not playing with the balloon. Actually, the child, the the small baby that she is holding is actually. Uh, uh, playing with the balloon. Balloon is red color. Okay, what's the boy's name? I don't know what the name. So ask, I ask him. him. Yeah, right. Ask him. I'm asking him the name. Okay. He said Tada. Tada. He said Tada. 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 I don't okay. know whether that's the name, but the boy is just 
maybe he's saying something mm-hmm. but he said tada so what should i do should i go to the mother or i see a jeep in the distance jeep. okay go uh, go and catch the jeep okay the jeep is like kind of a military jeep you know that right like yeah right right military. so i'm walking towards the jeep should i run or walk it is some, some run 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 okay i'll run I myself am wearing a blue shirt. <laughs> oh, good. Okay. I'm running. I got to the jeep. The jeep there is one man uh, sitting in the driver seat. Okay. It's an open jeep. Okay. I assume that man should be the husband of the woman. I don't know. Should I ask him something? Or yeah, right. Talk to him. Yeah. What talk to him. talk to him. What should I talk to him? Anything. Okay. Hi. uh should i say uh, uh the what is uh, uh, what is the voice cue what is his name should i ask him mm, yeah okay the man got up from the jeep he looks angry that i asked him this who are you to ask that he asked okay so should i come from that because he seems to be very angry person uh so should i walk away should i walk away no continue well <laughs> okay uh okay i will tell him not to get angry hold on okay i said him please don't get angry mm. he asked who am i mm, okay should i reply something yeah right what should i reply or should i reply with no so what should i say you you are wrong i will say about myself is it okay let me figure out who am i in this process okay My name is Badri. I work as a porter, porter in a village nearby. This what I am standing here is a town, and the town has a beach. So I have come to the beach to enjoy the vacation. Why I came here should I know? Should I know why I came here? Hmm. Yeah, I came here uh, because I wanted to actually get relaxation from stress. The owner whom I work for gives me a lot of work uh, in uh, to even do pottery in the night time, building pots. I mean, crafting pots. Correct? We got the language right. I'm building pots. Okay, pots, pots. Okay. That uh, my village uh, people use. So that is my nature of work. I come here for relaxation, to from the stress, uh, because uh, my hands seems to be very rough now. I don't know whether because I'm making pots or something, but it's different now. So uh, because of the pain that I get, uh, uh, I I decided to come for a doctor. Uh, but in fact, I wanted to my left mind my my deep corner of my mind says don't go for the doctor instead relax in a peaceful atmosphere. That's why I came to the beach. Okay. So that is What's that uh, army man? Army man. The army man is still standing here. I am next to him. What should I say? I should ask who is he? Ah uh, yeah, who is he? And wo- uh, what is the relationship ask, between that boy and him and uh, before, and that girl I lady? Before the too. woman comes, she's she's going to sit in the actual jeep now. Okay. Uh, the boy has also uh, the army man calls the boy to come. Okay. okay. Rahul he calls. So the boy is uh, running and coming. But he said Tada, you know. But Tada, name? I don't know because Tada maybe he just added Tada or something like that. But his real name is Rahul because uh, a boy may say a lot of uh, things, right? So Tada, I think is like a Tada or something like that. Maybe he finished the castle. Maybe he finished the sand castle and said Tada, I made it or something like that. I don't know. So, but the boy's name is Rahul. He comes and sits in the in the jeep, and the jeep goes away. Okay. okay. I have to go to the nearest bus stop, and okay. it's night time. The time should I check my watch? Yeah, right. The time is eight sixteen. Eight sixteen. Okay. PM. Okay, I know PM. Okay. But one thing uh, I I couldn't imagine is I hear the rustle of the leaves in that particular thing. Okay, in the tree, the rustle of the leaves that makes the noise. Okay. And the nice sounds of frogs. in the beach still comes to me okay? okay so is that all you're looking at or anything else you want from the scene 
No, nothing. Okay, so I, I will exit from the scene right now. You're right. Okay, okay. Badri, I mean, sorry, that is my name in the scene. I'm going to exit from the scene right now. Any other information you want about the scene, which year it, it is or what it is? Okay. You want uh, to know the which year and uh, date? Date, please. 2002. Okay. Feb 12. Feb 12, 2002. Yes. Okay, how you were looking in 2002? How you are looking in the sense? I don't have a mirror. Oh, sorry. Uh, like uh, you were too fat or uh, too lean. I am I'm, I'm, I'm medium. Too size. young. Medium size. Okay. If this is not me. This is Badri. So. Okay. Okay, Badri, Badri. Okay. So that's it. I will exit from the scene right now. Okay. Right. Thank you, guys. This is Strindi Ranganathan.